TruckLogix encompasses everything that you want to accommodate in a dispatch. You can add multiple loads to a single dispatch, generate separate invoices and BOLs for each client's load through Less Than Truck Load. From the dashboard, click Add New and then select Load from the drop-down menu. Then select the LTL option. If your TruckLogix account is not set up to automatically generate a load number, enter a new number now. You can set up TruckLogix to automatically generate a load number using the Load Settings button in the top right corner. Then you can enter the load creation date and time if this is an old load or a future dispatch. Choose whether your client is a customer, carrier, or broker. You can also notate yard moves and inventory transfers. If you have not added any customers, carriers, or brokers to your account, click the Add button. Enter the company name and email if you would like. Then add their billing address by typing the first few numbers of the address. You can additionally add the contact name of a particular individual. Then click Save. This customer will be saved to your address book for later. You can also add reference numbers, account numbers, and CTPAT. CSA number options are also available. By default, the shipper information will be automatically added as the customer, carrier, or broker information you already entered. You will need to add the pickup date and time, as well as any pickup instructions and the contact person at pickup. If the pickup contact has a phone number, add that. Add the BOL number if you have that as well. Next, add the cosignee. This process is the same as adding a customer, carrier, or broker. You can add additional shippers and cosignees by clicking save and add another. Now begin adding freight details. The description and declared value are required for generating BOLs later. Add a description of whatever you're hauling. Then enter the weight in pounds or tons. Enter the quantity in any measurement required. If possible, add the length, weight, height, and FC. Finally, add the declared value. You can add additional lines for additional types of freight. Add any additional freight details including trailer group, trailer types, and load type. Next, add freight charges. Enter the hauling fee in whatever way you will be paid. Then enter the rate. If you have any fuel surcharges, accessorial fees, or accessorial deductions, enter them now. Additionally, you should add mileage. This can be calculated using Google Maps or ProMiles. You can also just enter it manually. If you have any discounts, add that now. Then click Create Load. Now go out and find that load on the load screen. Create a new dispatch for it. Now you can add additional loads to the dispatch using the Add New Load button. Enter all the new details, then repeat this process for all your LTL loads. Sign up today and start your free 15-day trial with our trucking management software.